Hi guys. How's it going? Andrew brushing and boards and stenciled up. We're gonna paint. Got a hair hanging on my face. It's driving me nuts. Say hi when you come on. We're gonna paint us a turtle. Hi, Ellen Wellen on vacation. Hi, Vicky. I know, I got your shirt on again. Hi, Laura. And Harleen, how are, how are you guys? I hope good. You hear the birds? Hi, Kaylin and Cindy. We're gonna paint us a turtle. Hi, Cheryl and Sharon. Let's paint us this turtle. This is what we're painting, a turtle with a hat, with a ball cap. Hi, Nellie and Pam. Okay, I'm gonna turn you down so you can see what I'm doing. <clears throat> okay, so if you get this one, Hi, Sandy Stock. Man, it's big. I can't even get it all on the camera. Hi, Debbie and Pat. Thank you for sprinkling. If you get this one, when you're looking down on it, you want the head to the left. I had a good day. I worked all day. I had cemetery work to do today. Hi, Jeffrey and Janice from Georgia. How are you guys? The weather is very nice. It's like 80 and overcast. Hi, Alicia. Hi, Arlene. It looks like it's gonna rain. Hi, Lisa Hart Dangle. Hi, Doris. Okay, so we're gonna paint this turtle. And we're gonna paint, we're gonna use kudzu first. I see you, Julie McCoy, my friend. Hi, Tracy. Oh, got it. Happy Thursday, Carolyn. Okay, so I'm gonna go around the outside first, but there's not much. Hi, Cindy. Not much to go around the outside. Hi, Tina Doyle. So, you need the tail. Hi, Brenda. And the feet. All that's got to be painted around the outside. Hi, Laura and Peggy. Uh, Scott is busy with orders. You guys tore him up with orders for the sale. Hi, Myra. So, he's been slammed with getting the orders out. So, I'm sure he'll be back. He's just trying to get the orders out before his big order comes in, which it's there, but he's trying to get his orders out first. Hi, Wanda. I'm Paula Dean Doan. So that's where he is. <clears throat> Supposed to sew him tomorrow. Hi, Melissa. Nice, Arthurine. Did, so, did you sit on my porch? I did for about an hour today. Yep. Yep, I did. I love it. It's awesome. But, guys, it was really windy here today. Hi, Cole. It was really windy here today. Again, like yesterday. Okay, so on the inside of this, I need to go up this side. The turtle side. Hi, Holly and Tracy and Marty. So I need to get the inside of this part right here. And then around its face right here. Hi, Jill. How is everybody... How's all my friends? John, I missed it, John. Darn it. Hi, John and Sherry, probably. Sh oh, Sherry. A bit nippy there, Jeffrey. No, we didn't get any rain here today. Hi, Tony. No rain. I don't, I still haven't talked to Jana. Is she sick? I guess I need to call her. I didn't even know she was sick. Thank you, Wanda. Hi, Colleen. Okay, so I'm going to paint my turtle. I see you, Julie McCoy. Hi, hi, Julie. Oh, they're going fast, guys. You wore Shakar by hand. Hi, Zila. Okay, let me paint this turtle. <clears throat> so I'm painting his face. Hi, Marta and Tina. Painting his face and his neck. You had a roof put on today? Nice. 
Hi from England. Who said that? Hi, Julie Rice from England. I should have known it was you. Hi, Amanda. Hot there, Tony. Hi, Gloria. Okay. And I'm going to paint the bottom half of where the shell is. You don't need to paint the whole shell because that's going to be a different color. Hi, Alicia and Margie. So you need to paint the bottom half and the feet. Baseball size hail. Wow. I hope your car was now. Was your car out? Oh, she had no voice? Oh, I didn't know that. Guys, I haven't really talked to anybody lately. All right, that's all I'm painting, guys. Just that little bit right there. Oh, no. Hi, Cindy Witt. So, see what I got painted? I got... Can you even see? Since you're upside down, I got the head, the face, the neck. Hi, Gail and Janet. And the bottom of the body. So, I'm going to dry these, and I'm going to go over it again. We don't need anything else green. Oklahoma tornadoes. Jill, you're probably right. I just haven't heard. Hi, Melissa and Jilly Coy. So I'm going to get this dry because I'm going to go over it again. Somebody's been really waiting for this turtle. This green is kudzu. K-U-D-Z-U. K-U-D-Z-U. Kudzu green. Hi, Jeannie. And it's a pretty good color for a turtle. Hi, Pam. And Gloria. Hi, friends. How is everybody? On this Thursday. Oh, good. Yeah, car was up in the garage. Good thing. Hi, Nancy from North Carolina. Hi, Linda Pierce. Okay, we're going to get this dry. So I'm going to go over it one more time. Oh, nice, Alma. Awesome. Hi, Tina Smith and Gloria. All right, let's give this another coat. I got my car back. Yep, it's all fixed. I got it back Tuesday. Tuesday. Hi, Jill Tone. Thank you for sprinkling, Tina. Okay, so I'm going to go over the green parts again. Hi, Charbeth. Charbeth, I haven't seen you in forever. Where you been? I don't think I've seen you in forever. <clears throat> I like this green, too. Hi, Debbie. So I'm going over everything green again. Hi, Eleanor. And I didn't need to go up this high, but I did it anyway, because it's better to be safe than sorry. I'm good, Tina Smith. I'm good, I'm good. My car is perfect. Nothing wrong with it now. Hopefully they did the job. Hi, Lynn Richie. All right. We got that. Okay, we're done with the green. I'm going to get rid of this. And we're going to dry it. Hi, Sarah Evans. You love turtles. Hi, Stephanie. Got some in my eyeball. Hi, Susan. <clears throat> okay, let's dry the green. I think we're going to work from the top and work our way down. So we're going to do the hat next. Hi, Beth and Debbie. Debbie, oh, of Hollywood. Hi, Kathy. I thought it was saying your last name was Hollywood. Hi, Peggy. I see you, Shirley. Let's get this green really dry. Um, he's got a lot of orders that he's trying to get out, so that's why he hasn't been on. That sale made him busy, so he's got he's trying to get all his orders out. He'll be back. Thank you, Sharon. Oh, I've never been to Golden Corral. We don't go out to eat much. Myrtle the turtle. Is her name Myrtle? Hi, Doris. Thanks for sprinkling. Hi, Roxanne. Okay, I want to get this green really dry. The screen is called Kudzu. K-U-D-Z-U. No, I didn't call. I'm going to talk to Kurt about it. Hi, Denise. Kurt's been out of town all week for... For uh, work. Tyler's been here with me. Tyler and Lyra. But Kurt's been gone since so Monday. Hi, Janice. Hi, Serena. Thanks for the stars, Kathy. Okay. Let's do this hat. Hi, Lisa. 
Thank you, Janice. Okay, I'm going to turn it your way. We're going to do this ball hat right now. Hi, Doris. So you got stencils for it. And they are right here. So this stencil right here, not this little one, not that one. Ooh, nice, June. This one goes, and it's upside down. I might not be able to figure it out upside down. Hi, Donna. Oh, she loved turtles when she was little. I can't figure it out when it's upside down. I might not be able to figure it out when it's right side up either. Lord, how's this go? I know. Hold on. I get it. There. <laughs> I got it. <laughs> Thank you, Arthurine. Hi, Janet. I don't know why you had a hard time getting on. So this is one stencil, and it's going to go there. But I think I'm going to paint the top of the hat first. Kudzu. K-U-D-Z-U. Yep. Happy anniversary. I missed it, but happy anniversary. So here's what we're going to do. This is a stencil for the hat. We're going to start with this one. <clears throat> so what I'm going to do is this part goes right here. See this little 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 bump right here? Hi, Heather. See this little bump right here? That's where that goes. So just like that. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to pencil it in. You can use your stencil if you want, but, you know, I'm starting to like like in the hand painting. But believe me, you guys, these come with stencils, so you don't ever have to hand paint if you don't want to. Yeah, Scott's good. He's just really busy with the sale that he had, so he hasn't been on because he's trying to get all his orders out. So I'm going to draw a line. Hi, Sandra. Just the bottom of this right here, okay? And I'm going to finish it. I'm going to take it all the way across to this little lip right here. Let me show you. See right here? See that little lip right there? has to go from there to there, okay? But if you need your stencil, use it. Hi, Janet. So... <clears throat> I'm going to take that same stencil I just had out and halfway through this ball right here, it's going to be a different color. So all I'm going to do is just draw this line right here, which you could use the stencil too if you wanted to. Painted 140 and it's on the website. My numbers are door blank 731, wreath blank 732, painted 733. Hi, Evie Marie. Thank you, Danita. Okay, so these two are going to be two different colors. I want dark, and then I want white. So I'm going to do navy right here. Now I'm going to use my paint pen first so I can keep in my lines. Looks like a boob. <laughs> I don't see no boob. Okay, so the front one, the front piece is going to be navy. So I'm just going to, I'm going to do my lines so I know where to paint. So I'm just tracing over my pencil mark right now. So all this right here is going to be painted navy. Very easy. Hi, Amber and Janice. I'm just going to use me a little brush like this, a little angled brush. No, do you want me to, Ellen? You better tell me now. I was painting it blue. Okay, and I'm going to use in the navy. Hi, Denise. Ellen, are you wanting me to paint it red? He's, he's, he, yeah, he's done missed his 60 days, guys. He had that sale and he's got to get his orders out. So that's what he's doing. What is the wreath? What do you mean? What do you mean? Hi, Amber Zig Stallard. What you doing? I haven't seen you in forever. You was resting, JC. Okay, I'll, Ellen wants it red, guys. I guess I'll paint it red. Lord, she's awful bossy being on vacation and all. Hi, Nancy. Okay, we're doing cardinal red. We're doing it. So, I'm going to go up to my blue with my red. So, that's what we're doing now. Hi, Sander. Happy 73rd birthday. That's awesome. Hi, Dawn. Okay, I'm going up to my blue with my red. So, that's what I'm doing. So, I'm just going right up to the blue marker. No big deal, it's blue. It's just there to keep us in line, so. Looks like a boob. Now you can't unsee it. I still don't see the boob, guys. I don't see a boob. I'm telling you, I don't. So in this little corner right here, you'll probably be using your stencil, but I'm going to use a little brush to get in that corner. Just like this. And then I'll continue with my big brush. But you can totally use 
your stencil for this. You don't have to hand paint it. That's what the stencil comes with it for. I'm just getting to the point where I like to hand paint it now for some reason. But the stencils are totally usable. Okay, so I'm going to go around the outside of this red. We all talked about what? We all talked about it, Angie. I didn't talk about no red turtle. No, I did not. You guys mind if I did not. Hi, Tammy Grant. Are you and Ellen? Um, no, we're skipping the Sunday because Ellen would just be getting home from out of town. My work kitty's good. Hi, Rita. Okay, I'm going to go around the outside of this right now. You're welcome, Sandra. Lisa Anderson, did I get your email? Probably. I don't remember what it was about, but I'm sure I read it. Okay, that's done. Yeah, she won't be home till later. So this part right here is going to be white, but then this part here is going to be red again. So I'm going to dry this. I'm going to paint it red again, and then we're going to go, go to that part right there. A sick turtle. Hi, Lucy. Okay, let me dry that red. I'm not getting all the comments, so I'm confused. Oh, Joyce, that's all right. No, we didn't, Ellen. I don't remember nothing about that. Seriously. I must have missed that part. Hi, Tabby. Bulldog. Yes, Bulldog. Um, guys, I found a bunch of dogs. I just, I'm going to have to show you the pictures on a, on a live or something because I can't. I can't get it like the Yorkie one that I had. Only a couple of them I can get like the Yorkie one. Hi, Beverly. So I'm going to have to show you the pictures in the email because I don't even know if you're going to want these ones. I mean, I, pro I mean, I just don't remember it at all. Usually, if I can remember if you... You sure I was on the video chat, girls? Yeah, he's not. He's fine. He's just working on orders. He's got a lot of orders. Oh, the wreath number. Wreath blank is 732. 732. Hi, Kathleen. Sorry, I didn't know what she was talking about. 732 for the wreath blank. All right, there's our red hat. Now we're going to go to this part right here, which we have a stencil. That wasn't the turtle, was it? I thought that was something else. I thought that was something else. Oh, I thought, I didn't know it was the turtle. I remember that conversation, yeah, but I didn't know it was the turtle. Sorry. Okay. <clears throat> They're all trying to confuse me, guys. I think we're going to do our white next. So the white, this other half of the hat is white. Absolutely the turtle. Yeah, I didn't know that. That's right. Okay, so let me get my white. And I think I need a smaller brush. What else do you have that has a baseball hat? I don't know. I didn't even know it was supposed to be going in the hat. Girl, you know my memory. I can't see the boob. People's talking about the boob. I can't see it. Okay, I'm taking my white. I have not lost it yet. I'm just going to go over my pencil mark, and that's going to be painted white. Me too, Deborah. Obviously, I have to write it down because I don't even remember. I mean, I remember the conversation, but I didn't think it was the turtle. I thought it was something else. Okay, we're going to paint our white in. Right, Julie, they're confusing me. They know I'm confused enough. Don't help me. All three of them are confusing me. That's not nice. Oh, I see it now. <laughs> I see it now. <laughs> I see it. The nipple. Are you talking about the nip? <laughs> I see it. I didn't start that, though, just to let you guys know. But I do see it now. All right, I'm going to go around the outside. Right. Tell them, Rita. Tell them. Tell them, Rita. Tell them. Wait till you're older. Be making fun of you because you can't remember nothing. All right, let's dry this and go over this white again. Not funny. I'm not slow. I just, I didn't say it first. One of them did. Alicia's trying to backpedal now. Huh. 
Thank you, Laura. I do, I do. Took me long enough. I know. Well, you guys got to think. You're looking at it upside down. I'm not. So that's why you can see the boob more than I could. I'm looking at it the right way. Thank you, Jill. Somebody's got to have my back because these girls are picking on me tonight. Okay, let's go over this black. Or white. White. Not black. White. I know my colors. White. We're going to go over this again. All right, got one of the hats done. We're gonna dry it. See, they start it all the time. I would have never thought of that either because I'm not dirty minded like they are. I do too, short term memory. Ha, you gotta remember where he wrote it down. That's hilarious. That's hilarious. Hi, Kathy. Ugh, I'm tired. Okay, that's dry. Now we're gonna do this part of the hat, and it's gonna be red, because Ellen Wellen wanted red. So, I'm gonna take my stencil out for that part. I know, weren't they cute, Serena? This is the stencil I'm using, this one right here. You can't help it, Vicky. <laughs> All right, so it goes like this. So it's gonna go right up to your white, and I'm only gonna use this for my for my curve. That's the only reason I'm using the stencil. Yeah, finding them is the problem. Um, you can use your stencil, remember. I'm not going to. So I'm just drawing my line of where I want this hat to be. Okay? Just like that. And it's gonna be red. And I'm gonna use my red paint marker so I can stay in the lines. Hi, Rhonda. Thank you, Cheryl, for the stars. So, I am going to go right over my pencil marker. Just like that, and I'm gonna paint that in red. Oh, see. And <laughs> Deborah, that's funny. Okay, now I'm gonna do my red. I need my little paintbrush again to get in that little corner right there. Just like this. Guys, use your stencil if you need it. Seriously. No shame in using a stencil. I'm blurry on and off? I don't know what's wrong with this stuff. I'm not blurry at all on my camera. I don't get it. It don't make sense. Just like that. Ooh, I almost dipped it in white. That would have been horrible. Hi, Joanne. The last pair of slippers took me 10 years to find them, she said. That's hilarious. Okay, right up against my white, just like that, and paint it in. Not blurry, good. So there's my hat. I'm going to dry it and go over it one more time. Not blurry for anybody else, good. Okay, let's dry this hat. Not blurry. If you get blurry, go out and come back in. I gotta do the outside of the hat right there, too. You're welcome, Stephanie. Hi, Kathy. That was a lot of stencils, girlfriend. That was a lot of stencils. All right, let's go over this again. I'm gonna get my outsides first. So you got a little spot right in here. See that right there? That's gotta be red. And then that's gonna be red. So let's do that. Right, Patricia. That's probably why I cray cray a lot of the times because I gotta deal with Scott's butt. He makes me cray cray sometimes. Anybody would be crazy. Okay, I'm doing my sides of my red. All right, let's go over the top of the red and then we're gonna move on to the shell. Hi, Sharon. Let's dry this. Really? I don't know, Julie, that's messed up. You see it all now, cute? You see the booby too? 
Then they said that they see. Let's go over this red. So I'm gonna get my little corner first. Don't, don't ask me that, right? Don't ask me that, Julie. You know better. Now let's fill the rest in. Oh, good, Shirley. All right, that's done. Now. Uh, Janice. I do for a lot of things, but if it comes with the wood piece, I don't usually, but I will if you need it. Does that make sense? Nobody's ever asked me that before. Okay, let's dry the red and cover that up. Storms all over. It's really getting dark here from the clouds. <laughs> Julie. But no rain yet. I'm surprised. Have you heard? How, no, I haven't heard from Jana at all. Hi, Susan. She usually texts me, but she hasn't texted me in a while. All right. Now, let me see what I want to do next. Ooh, we're going to do our shell next. So, let me think of the easiest way to tell you guys to do this. Oh, you do? Ooh. Nice, Janice. Uh -huh. Okay, see this stencil right here? This is the bottom of the shell. So, here's where it goes. See that little lump right? Whoop, you can't see nothing. See that little lump right there, right by the neck? That's that's the bottom of the shell. Ew, all day Saturday, that makes it an achy weekend. So you line this up, and all you're gonna do is, you just, you just wanna stencil this in. I'm not gonna stencil it, I'm gonna use my pencil. So, I'm gonna use my pencil and just get the bottom of the shell is all I want. I just want the lines from the bottom of the shell. That's it. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to paint this whole thing right here chocolate brown. Thank you, Tabby. I'm going to paint this whole shell chocolate brown, and then we're going to add to it. But it's just easier to paint the whole thing chocolate brown first. So that's what we're going to do. So chocolate brown and a, and, a, and a paintbrush. You guys can use your stencil if you want. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go right up next, which you should probably put your paint marker on here. I didn't, but you could to help you stay in the lines. You know it's easier. I got a booger. I don't like paint boogers. Ah, uh -huh. Hold up. I got a paint booger. Got it. Hi, Debbie. So I'm painting the just right next to my pencil marks is what I'm doing right now. And then I'm going to paint all this shell chocolate brown. So I'm going to go right up next to my hat and paint the rest in. And then we're going to go around the outside. <clears throat> and right in here needs to be brown too. So let's get that while we're at it. On the inside of the shell. Got it. Now just fill it in. Super simple. Have you? No, this turtle doesn't have a name. I just named him Turtle with Hat on the website. Guys, it gets hard to name all these signs. All right, so see that? Oh, we gotta go around the outside of this side too. And we're gonna dry it. And we're going to see if we need another coat. I don't know if we do or not. We'll check it out in a second. So go around your outside of the brown part. All right. Let's dry this and see if we need another coat. Because we're going to do another color brown on top of it. You like the red cap? That was Ellen's idea. Hi, Tammy Pitts. Okay. Let's dry that brown and see if we need another coat. We might be all right. 
So let's try it and see. There's only a few things that's gonna be different, color brown. Um, Alicia, will you type that in? Alicia will answer you with that. She's got it like programmed into her phone or something. I always get the name wrong. And it's across the room. If she don't, I'll go get it. Hi, Fonda. I think for a lot of things, Alicia has a little button that she copies and pastes all kinds of stuff that she has to say all the time. Seems like, because she types it so, there it is. She types it so dang fast. That's what I use. Rust-Oleum 2X Ultra Covered Clear Gloss Sealer. Two coats. She's awesome. Alright. Now, I don't need another coat. So what we're going to do... Oh, nice, Amber. Oh, it's coming towards you. Hi, Donna. So, let me show you what we're going to do next. I'll never tell my secrets. You're funny. Okay. So here's our shell stencils. See all these stencils right here? We're gonna paint these pine cones, Julie's favorite color. So let me get some stuff out of my way. We're gonna stencil these. So, if you get this one, you're gonna have to watch the video to see where these go, okay? That's just how it works. You're gonna have to watch the video. Let me think. First, we're gonna take this brush that I already use. I'm gonna wipe a little of the white off. But it doesn't matter if I have a little white on it. I'm going to wipe a little of the white off. And we're going to finish the, sh the bottom of the shell first. Tornado watch. Be safe, Kathy. So what you're going to do is, now I'm going to do this by hand. you got to stencil. I'm going to go right back over, right up to my green again. Because this bottom part is going to be this, this um, pine cone. All in one day, Tracy. Thank you, Linda. So I'm just going right up next to my green again. I'm going over this again. It was just easier to paint it all chocolate first. And then at this lip right here, see this little lip right here? That's where we're going to paint the bottom of the shell. So it's going to go like this. Just like that. Super simple. So see that? That's all you're going to do. And paint it in. Very easy. Fill it in. Super simple. Then get the outside that you already did chocolate, but it's all right. Get the outside pine cone right in here and right on the outside piece over here. All right. So we're going to dry this. And then we're gonna paint, use these to paint our stencils. Hi, Melody. So let's dry this part right here. It's pine cone. It is easy, Linda. It's getting easier. I didn't used to know how to hand paint at all, but since I've been using the stencils, it's kind of taught me how to hand paint some. And if you hand paint, if you use the paint markers to draw it out first, it really helps you stay in the lines for hand painting. But if you have to use the stencils, there's no shame in that. Use the stencils. I want to get this really dry because I'm going to use a stencil next and I don't want it to pull off my paint. Alright, we should be good. Now, if you get this, you're going to have to go back and watch which ones I used where. So this one right here. Okay, the one at the bottom right of your stencil is going to go right here. Just right there. And I'm going to stencil it. You want a beautiful day? Everybody wants a beautiful day. We had one yesterday and today, but man, it was windy. You could barely sit outside. It was so windy. Okay, so I'm going to take a stencil brush. I'm going to use pine cone again. And I'm going to do this little spot on the turtle. We'll probably stencil it twice, even though you only use the paintbrush once.
Maybe not, though. We'll see what it looks like when I dry it. I might not have to do it again. Okay, let's dry that. And we're going to do two more on the shelf after this one. Rain and storms. I don't like rain. Rain is horrible. Storms are horrible. I like to listen to the rain and the storms, but I don't like rain and storms. Nope, we don't need another coat. So we're going to pull that one off. <clears throat> so pull that one off. See this little spot right here? Fill it in. You miss a little spot, fill it in. No big deal. And then this next one, so the one to the left of the one you just used, you're going to use this one next. And it's going to go right down here at this other side. And we're just going to stencil it in again. You need it there in Texas? We don't need rain here. You can have all the rain you want, as long as it don't rain here. Low 90s? Oh my gosh. That's soon, isn't it? I mean, that's early for 90s? Seems like, but maybe not in California. Alright, that one's done. Let's pull this off. See them spots that it didn't cover? Take your brush and cover it. Super simple. Just like that. Dry it, and then we got one more of those to do. <clears throat> Hi, BJ. My day was good. Worked out in the garage all day. Did some cemetery work. <clears throat> Your garden needs some, Jeffrey. All right, one more. And that's this top one right here. This one right here. And it's going to go right at the top. Just like that. right here you are we get the outside right here with this pine cone all right so that's what we got so far guys see that looks a little messy but it'll be cleaned up hi Connie we're painting a turtle it's a turtle with a ball cap all right now we're going to do our face. We're going to do our face. So, you got an eyeball. Here's the eyeball. The eyeball goes right in here to where the eyelash almost touches your hat. Almost. And it's going to be black. So we're going to stencil this in. Black. Let me dump some of these brushes. Oh, you see it now? Okay, so I need some black for the eyeball. Turning cooler. I think it's supposed to turn cooler here, too. Okay. Hold your stencil down as you go. And paint in your eyeball. Thank you, Danita. So there's my eyeball. See that? Now we're done with that. Guys, we're ready for paint marker already. Let's dry our eyeball, but we're ready for paint marker. Thank you, Rita. So we're going to dry our eyeball and then this patch we didn't dry. And then we're ready for some paint marker. I know I love the lashes. Next week's in the 60s. Ugh. Thank you, Eleanor and Janice. All right, we're gonna start with our fat black paint pen and then we're gonna move to our medium. So, fat black paint pen first and we're gonna go all the way around the outside. Hi, Linda. So, this ball right here, this ball, remember the ball I was talking about? I'm gonna paint that in black. I want it black, so all I'm doing is finishing it off and painting it in, just like that. 
I'm gonna get the outside of it with the black paint pen. All right. Do you, yes. Um, all the paint markers I buy are on my link tree on my Amazon. I buy them all, pretty much all from Am Amazon, my paint markers. So I'm just going to take this pin and I'm going to go all the way around the outside with the fat black paint pin, just like this. Hi, Louise. Thank you, Debbie. So all the way around. Ooh, that's still dry. That's still wet. That's not good. We're gonna skip that one and we'll come back to it because that's still wet. So guys, when you're using paint pen, you gotta make sure you get all your paint dry, oops, dry before you use it. Or else it's gonna like sink into your paint and it sucks when, it, when that happens. So you wanna try not to do that like I just did, but it's fixable. Thank you, Brenda. So I'm going all the way around the outside with my fat black paint pen. Just like this. I'm gonna get the outside of right inside here. Thank you, Nellie. All right, now. Now we're gonna do our hat. We're gonna go down the lines of our hats with the fat black paint pen, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna choose the, the skinny side of the fat black paint pen. So I'm gonna go straight down this line, just like that. Down this middle line. And then down this brim of the hat that's on backwards. So there's our hat. Now I'm going to go around these these patches on the shell, whatever they're called, with my fat black paint pen. Before I do the bottom two, I'm gonna do this, well, I don't know what this is called, the little scallop part at the bottom. Just like this. So you're just tracing what you already did. Thank you, Donna. And then the bottom part. And now I'm gonna finish these two. Angie, do you, what'd that say? I missed it during. Uh, do you have a cat board? I do, I have one on my website and I just did another one yesterday that I have not painted on live yet, but it's coming soon. So I'm gonna have two. I got one on my website already, but I'm gonna do another one in the next week or so. So I'm going around these little, whatever they're called on the shell, patches, I don't know. All right, now. Now, you have to separate your legs. So, right here's a leg. You can totally tell where they are, okay? We're gonna let this little belly line come out just a little bit. And you got a leg right here, which it comes down and goes out for a toe just a little bit. That's all you gotta do. And then this one, we want to come out a tiny bit. All right. Hi, Mary Bo. Bye, Janet. <clears throat> now we're ready for our medium. We're gonna, what we're going to do with the medium is we got to draw in some toenails. And these are really easy. All you're going to do is just put two kind of half circles right down here. And these are going to be his toenails. And color them in. You're going to do one here because the other one's kind of behind this leg. Posca, yep. Posca pins is all I use. You're going to have two right here. And these are just kind of like toenails, guys. And color them in, all with your paint pen. And then you're gonna have, thank you, you're gonna have two down here. So these are all his little turtle toenails. Okay, so see that? 
Now, you got a mouth. There is no stencil for the mouth. Franklin. Oh, yeah. He does kind of look like Franklin. All right, so let me show you this part. See his face right here? See this little dip right here? That's where his mouth's going to go up. So you need to start his mouth on the little dip right here. So what you're going to do is you're just going to bring kind of a line up just like that and then put that on the end of it. And that's his mouth. See that? Right there. Start it right there on that dip. Now, now we're going to take a white marker and kind of highlight it a little bit and put a dot in his eye and then we're done. This one's, it was pretty easy, guys. This one's pretty easy. So we're going to, first we're going to put a dot in his eye, just like that. Thank you, Sierra. And then we're just going to put some highlights with our white paint pen in here. Wherever you think you might need some. It's just totally random. Hi, Colleen. Just like that. And he's done. He is really cute. Let me show him to you with, let me pull you up and show him to you. My face is itching. Okay, you ready? He's adorable. So here he is. That's my turtle with a, with a ball cap. So this is this one. Isn't that cute? Hi, Brenda. And here's the one I painted first with the blue ball cap. So I have two of these available. So if you guys want one, if you want a specific color, you have to put it in the notes if you get one of these. Aren't they cute? So that's the first one with the blue hat. And then this is the one I just did on the live. Look how adorable he is. If you like turtles, this is your guy because he's, he's cute. So that's it. Very easy and very quick. That only took us 45 minutes, guys. And that was with me talking a ton. I know he's so stinking cute. I might have to keep one of them because I like turtles. I like turtles. You guys ever, I don't even know who said that. I like turtles. It's on a movie or something. Probably nobody knows what I'm talking about. Hi, D. So we're all finished. I'm going to clean up my mess. And go sit down. Thank you, Virginia. And I've been watching 2020. A lot of 2020 lately. I like those shows on 2020. Thank you, Betsy and Julie McCoy and Joyce. So, guys, the dogs, I've found a bunch. Well, I can show you a few right now since we have time. Let me, let me take you over there to the computer. And I'll show you a few. But I don't know if the people that asked for these are on here is my problem. So let me get my computer going, and I'll show you a couple that I'm talking about. Because some of them I can't get just like that um, Yorkie that I had. Hi, Gloria. So let me pull them up. Let me see. So here is the Shih Tzu. And the Shih Tzu I could do. The Shih Tzu, I found one like the Yorkie. So whoever wants a Shih Tzu, this is the Shih Tzu. Hi, Kathy. That's the Shih Tzu, okay? It's a little harder than the Yorkie, but it can be done. So that's that one. Now, the other ones, let me show you. I know, Ellen. He does. Uh, this is the, shoot, I don't even remember what this dog is called. My internet's going out. Here's, my internet keeps going out. Here's a dog that somebody had me look for. Something, short hair pointer, something somebody did, told me. I will show the turtle again. So that's one of them. I couldn't get one of those just like the Yorkie, so it would have to be that. Um, here is a wiener dog. I couldn't get like the Yorkie, but I could do that one. With just that dog. And then, let me see what else I found. A lot of them I can't find like the Yorkie. Now, this one I did, the French Bulldog. That's kind of like the Yorkie, so I could do that one. Golden Retriever I have not looked for. Yeah, that was the pointer. I could do this little guy. And then somebody asked for a lab, so it would have to be this, because I can't find nothing else easy enough to paint for a lab. That totally looks like a lab, though. It kind of looks like Sammy. 
Um, let me see if, oh, this one. This one, beagle. Somebody asked for a beagle. And that's what it would look like for the beagle. Let me see if there was any more. Hold on. Um, I think that, oh, no, this one. Somebody asked me for this one, and I can't even remember what it's called. I forgot what this is called. The shepherd something. I don't know. But somebody asked me for this one. So that's what they would look like, guys. I couldn't find a lot of them like the Yorkie that I did. So that's the only things I could find. So if you're wanting any of those, email me. Because I'm not going to do a live on every one because they're not going to get sold. My boards and stuff. So I would rather not do a live on every one unless somebody wants one for sure. Chihuahua, let me see if I can find one real quick. Hold on. Akali. Let me look for the Chihuahua first. A Corky. Akali. I don't know what a Corky is. I don't even know how to spell Chihuahua. C-H-I. How do you spell Chihuahua? Where'd that go? Where is it? C H I H C H I H U A H U A A Morky. Um what am I looking for? Silhouette. Okay, so let's see what they got for Chihuahuas. Oh, they got some cute ones. Now, I'm not seeing the one. Yeah, individual, and I can't do them all because I could do one dog and nobody buys it, and it's just like a waste of time for me. You know what I mean? Not to be mean, but it's a waste of time for me. So I could do something like that, like his whole body right there. Or here's one, but, man, that's going to have a lot of inserts, guys. That one's going to be kind of hard. That's a lot of inserts. My Yorkie one didn't have any inserts, and that's a lot of inserts. So, that's the Chihuahua. I painted a turtle. I'll show it to you before we get off here. See, all the Chihuahuas except the solid one is going to have a lot of inserts. And you guys don't want a lot of inserts, because that's a pain in the butt. Yeah, I think it would have to be a custom order for a pet one because I can't just go and paint all the dogs because it would be, you know, worthless for me, most of them. You get what I'm saying? And a lot of time. So it would have to be, you would have to email me if you want a dog. It looks like yours. But guys, I can show you. This is my silhouette. So this is how I cut my stuff. So I just drag it to here or I design it on here. And then I cut it. And this is, it's, it cuts out exactly like that. So that's how I cut my stencils. A labradoodle. See, I can look for all those. But you guys, you guys got to be serious about which one you want. Because it takes a lot of time to look for these dogs. So if you really don't want one going out so if you really don't want a dog kind of don't ask for it but if you want one i'll look for one for you get what i'm saying all right guys let me show you my turtle one more time and then i'm out of here so here's the one i just painted see that turtle i can't turn my phone it won't let me there's the one i just painted and there's the first one i painted so i got a blue a blue hat and a red hat one isn't it cute i love that turtle I think it's adorable. All right, guys. I'm going to hop off here and go eat and sit down and enjoy some TV. So I will probably see you guys tomorrow. Um, only reason I wouldn't go is if I have to go up and help Scott unload the or put everything away. So I'm not sure totally yet. But I will probably be on, but I can't tell you 100%. All right, guys, you guys have an awesome night. Thanks for hanging out with me. I appreciate all of you. Have a good evening. Bye.